Hey there, so I uh, ordered this Wanderer quad fold beach cart from BCF. The order for click and collect. The box itself, I opened it up already. Let's just take a quick look at the wheels. So first thing I noticed was this is kind of a rubberized plastic feel to it. So it's not entirely plastic, so just in that. A lot of plastic here, very solid. And the metal bracket here is very solid as well. very close at the top of that so doesn't matter anyway anything that sticks to it dirt sand will just get rubbed off and very wide wheels there Ooh, so let's look at the rest of it so, more wheels away Two more wheels there, and that's the. Whoa. There we go. So you can see it folds up pretty compact. And also the base of the unit as well. So let's see how it looks like when it all assembled again just looking at the um, frame here and yeah, that's where the wheels going I guess so, let's check it out okay I'm just putting on the wheels so you can see there's slots for square at the back I'm guessing and circle ones at the front so I guess the back ones are pretty locked in like shopping carts and the front's going swivel. Again, like a swap shopping cart. Here's one here. That's obviously a square end. And it doesn't matter which way you put in. I guess don't put it that way, but put it this way. And I'll show you the front end here. And that's the circle one. This one here. I wonder how this actually fits in. Yeah. You can always take it out and put it back in. Actually, this might go inside like that. How do we take it off? It's got a locking mechanism on it. Okay, so I had to spread it apart a bit for the wheels to fit in with each other. So, here we go. So, that's the front wheel, I guess, because that has the circular look to it. So, put that in. It's a bit stiff. There we go. So, that's locked in. It's on the back wheels. So that one is the square looking one, it's in the back, locked in, it's another back one with the square, so you can see it doesn't matter which way you put it in, oh. Let's adjust that. Yeah. And that's all the wheels on. Okay, let's open it up. Okay. 
Okay. Back. Goes in like that. Uh, I don't really see any brakes in it. Don't think it really needs it, but would have been nice. I'm on a bit of a slope here, so. There we go. So, just the base of it. I'll give you a look here. Just the inside here. Has this mesh here, so I guess sand can, can you know, clean your sand for it. And the base is supported on these metal bits here, so it's pretty solid. I'm just going to put that in and see how it looks. Alright, so here it is all assembled. Put the base in. So let's take a look inside while we're there. So, pretty solid. Very good material feel to it. It's got this little pocket here for whatever you want, which is great. Take a look in the front. It's got these straps here, so you can put an umbrella or whatever, horizontal. It's even got a strap here as well, strap here and here. That's for when you want to put a beach umbrella through those two straps and onto the sand. So, let's take a look at the back. So these are the back wheels with the fixed wheels. The front one has the swivels because that's where the handle is. And the back has these two pockets here. I suppose for drinks or whatever you want. One side. Other side doesn't really have anything. Got this nice little grounding. Here we go, that's the handle. So, there's no real adjustments, there's only storage mode. Can't even pull it on the small mode, you have to pull it to the maximum, snap in, and there we go. So you can see you can pull it like this. So the joints are thick plastic, so hopefully this will last pretty long, well hopefully it does, it's got one year warranty. This joint here is plastic as well. And the handle here is plastic as well. Okay, let me press that. So I'm taking this beach day, so I'll see how these big wheels handle it. And I'll look at the wheels again. Because again, it, it's just rubberized kind of plastic, so it's not exactly hard plastic. So it won't make a, you know, that cheap plastic noise on concrete. But it's also wide, which is great for the beach. Supposedly. So let's take a look. So and have another quick look around the edges. Metal, plastic joints. So pretty solid stitching. And bracing here. Cool. Take a look at the stats. Okay. 110 kilogram weight limit. You can carry little, two little kids in there if you want. Key features. So it folds to a small package. 
Stand up my handlebar. Mesh. That's got all the straps and loops there. Yep. Okay. And pack up is a breeze as well. So let me just take the base out. That way. So in the middle here, this is pull tab. You just kind of pull up and it folds up. Go. Squash it up like an accordion. There we go. And then you wrap around it the actual base that we took out to keep it all together. Uh, let's give that a go. Okay, so this is how it looks like all packed up. A nice new little package. Easily put in your car. And if you need more space, you can actually take off the wheels. Okay, so to take off the wheels, there's these yellow buttons here. This engages the lock. You can pull it out. I guess I have to do this with um, two hands, but let's try it with one hand. There we go. If I had two hands with this, it would be a lot easier. You kind of have to hold it and pull it out at the same time. Okay, you get what I'm saying? Okay, so here we go. So that's with the wheels taken off. So it's even an, an even smaller package for the car. Just to give you some sizes. That's about 55 centimeters long. And 200, well, 25 centimeters wide in a kind of a square shape. So a very small package. So let's see how the wheels perform at the beach.